Hi, I'm Mike D. Simone. And I'm Jeff Jensen, and together we're the World Wine Guys. Welcome to our show, World Wine Guys, What We're Drinking. This week, we're talking about Pinot Noirs for summertime. You know, Pinot Noir has been called the red wine for white wine drinkers. It's a little bit lighter, a little bit fruitier in, in most of the times, and it's just a little bit less heavy in these well, hot it has, summer It has months. much softer tannins than it a lot does, of the other yeah. red grapes that we drink, like uh, Cabernet Sauvignon, right. for example. So it really goes with a lot of the lighter foods that we right. eat during summer. Um, if you have some uh, like fruit in a salad, mm -hmm, like some peaches right. or something, and maybe a mustard dressing, it'll go with that. Um, it also goes with chicken, it goes with pork, shrimp. and it goes with a shrimp, and it goes yeah. with some seafood like tuna as well. Exactly. So, so Pinot Noir is really one of those perfect uh, summertime red wines. I, I happen to love Pinot Noir sitting out in the backyard, you know, with some uh, good shrimp on the barbie, for example, or some chicken. So let's talk about the first one. The first one is Talbot Cali Hart Pinot Noir. So Cali Hart was the founder's daughter. Yeah, That's Rob right. Talbot founded Talbot Winery. And so this is from Monterey right. in California. So Monterey is in the northern part right. of California's central coast Correct, yeah. region. Um, and uh, why don't we give this baby a uh, try? I've been smelling it. I know. I'm just standing I know. Here, That's, so. I, me too. Cheers. I'm like... Let me get my nose. You know, in I'm there. getting like a lot of just a touch of oak, but it's yeah. really you know fruit forward. Right. I'm getting a lot of red berries, red raspberry, cherry. I mean, it smells really, really beautiful. Even a little bit of like cherry cola. Yeah, there's a little bit of cola yeah. on there too. Yeah. Okay. It's really nice. All right. Well, let's give that a taste. Let's taste it. Cheers, everyone. Thanks for watching. Mm. Wow. That. Really is a beautiful Pinot Noir. You know, besides the fruit, you've got blackberry, but then yeah. you've got like some, uh, like we those mountain herbs, like um, like oregano, like oregano yeah. and thyme. But it's got really beautiful acidity on the finish. And well. that's what's really nice about it. It's got like a nice crisp finish. It, it's fruity, um, and it's a persistent finish. But it's nice. It's got a good amount of acidity, so it'll go good with summer foods, right? Absolutely, it will. And this is available at Wine.com, and it's twenty one dollars. I really like this. I can just keep smelling this I one all I know, day. but we've got more to move on oh, to, Oh, okay. Jeff, so. all, right. <laughs> all right, so this next one is Siduri Santa Barbara County Pinot Noir. Um, Siduri was founded by um, Adam Lee, mm -hmm. um, who yep. actually, um, he has moved on and there's a new winemaker there, but Siduri is the name of the Babylonian goddess of wine. So I love that. That's really cool, right? Yeah, I mean, everyone knows, you know, uh, Dionysus, exactly. you know, Dionysus, right? But nobody knows Siduri. Siduri, you know? exactly. She's, so she's the goddess. So that's pretty cool. And you know, Siduri specializes in single vineyard Pinot Noir from um, cold climate sites, like from Santa Barbara all, all the way up to into Oregon. Oregon. Yeah. So this is the farthest south of right. the uh, the Siduri Pinot Noir. This one Noirs. smells beautiful. So this mm -hmm. one is fermented partial whole cluster. So that gives it like a little bit of uh, earthiness, you know. Yeah, you can smell, smell that. It's like also, bramble. But there's fruit in there. There's ber there's red berries in there. But there's also like some a little like cinnamon and star anise, almost a and, five spice powder. And like fig too. Yeah, I'm getting some yes. fig there. Well, let's give it a taste, All right. right? Cheers. Cheers. Wow, that's mm. really nice too. It's nice, really, really smooth on the palate. But a um, touch of spice too. Touch of spice in there. Um, it's got that, you know, again, the berry flavors um, with the spice, with those, uh, with the, the star anise. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. And the cinnamon. It's a little tiny bit, and it's from the um, from the whole cluster fermentation. Mm -hmm. It's a little tiny bit chewy, but then like the acidity really right. like like rescues that. And it's, this it's one's a wonderful wine. Really nice wine as well. This one's great with all different kinds of food on the on the barbecue. Um, so many different options in the summertime, you know. So buy a couple of these bottles, open them up, 
and share them with your family and friends. That's why we show you three, so you can buy all three. So but, this is available at yourwinestore.com, and right. it's $30. Another great wine at a great price. Okay, so now we're gonna move across the Pacific Ocean. Thank we you. have two from California, right? Um, and now we are moving to New Zealand, and this is Villa Maria Private Bin Marlboro hmm. Pinot Noir. Yeah, it smells so different than the California. Yeah, it does. Um, so the main winery uh, at Villa Maria is on uh, up on the North Island in Auckland. But this Pinot Noir comes from Marlborough, which is on the South Island. And we've been lucky enough, we've had lunch with Sir George and Lady Gale. Um, they received their order of the British Empire, their, yeah. their knights and ladies, and um, really super people. When Croatians came to um, New Zealand, they brought their winemaking skills. But enough about history, let's taste this one. All right, so cheers. Cheers. Mm. Very nice. You know, this is also very fruit forward on the nose. Right. You've got like right. strawberry, cherry, raspberry, but then like once you get it in your mouth, um, you've got those berries, but it's got a little bit more depth to it. There's um, like that yeah. mocha, like that chocolate covered espresso yeah, bean. but like coffee. I'm yeah. like espresso. Yeah, coffee and chocolate, exactly. Yeah. That's a, a little bit of spice on this one too. So um, I think this, you know, there, there are three different Pinot Noirs. Um, Really, really wonderful expressions of Pinot Noirs that go perfect, in my opinion, for summertime foods, you know, family gatherings, barbecues. And this one, actually, you can get at b21.com, and it's about $16 a bottle. So all three of these are very affordable, great wines to have with your family and friends. Yeah, you know, we just really wanted to, um, you know, give a shout out to all the red wine lovers out there because right. it's been warm weather. We know we've been um, kind of inundating everyone with right. the rosés yes. and with the white wines and with the sparkling wine. And so, um, summer Pinot Noir, this one goes out to you, all you red wine drinkers. It does. I'm Mike D. Simone, And I'm Jeff Jensen, and we'll see you next week. And until that time, cheers. Cheers. cheers.